Hello, I'm back inside of the Ravager, ready to take those damn Sith Lords down. Let's go. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's okay. Let me just do this first. Yep, dead. Deal with that. Swan hit. Mm -hmm. Okay. I want to look into the other door too. Okay. Wasn't expecting. Come on. Come on. Nice. There does this go? We have two ways around with this, I think. Yep. Come on, go! One more left. Hmm. Should I look into that? You have one for me? Is that the main bridge? So let's just go around. Look for more things in here. Hello. And here is what? one of the target sites. Place the proton core, prime it. Then give the signal, Mandalore. <laughs> okay. Blind Arming ship and I'm received, not... Mandalore. The proton core is active. We still need to set three more charges. Mandalore, we are holding our position, but the Sith appear to be offering little resistance. It's like they don't even realize we're here. <laughs> Hold on your position and we'll set the rest of the charges. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Creepy music. <laughs> I like it. Oh, hey. Alright then, we move on. And what's in here? So easy. <laughs> Stuff. Zebra field armor? Mm, not much. Okay, it was just moving around. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, something. Okay. Another locker? I didn't see it, how come? It's just nothing. And here we go. Let's go other way around before facing those people over there because it seems like 
there's something with them waiting over there in the middle. Oh, another missile bay. Proton core is locked into its bay and it cannot be removed. It could detonate if you tried, but it would be best to leave it. Hmm. Okay. Look at the places. So we're not going to use that one. No? Oh, hi! Where are you? This will be too far away. And we are moving forward. And it's empty. Okay. There's a room that I need to enter here. You wait me over there. I'll go and look into this place here. Let's go. Down here. And it's your turn. Take it. So this, these are the ones that I try to avoid actually. Improve. Well, this is Captain. You are no match for us. Maybe you can take that? Alright. Let's go this way. Is there anything related to the story in this place? Or is it just. you know. Nothing. Okay. This is probably, yeah. So, okay, we move on. Hello. Droids. Okay, not really working that good. Alright. Well, smart of them. I shall make this one. Let's make them down again. <laughs> okay. The wits. Yep. And an attack. More over there. Okay. There's a little room over here. going to set charger somewhere over here? What are we going to do? Okay, just some bedrooms. Oh, take it. What? This door leads to my cell. Ah. I had forgotten. Hmm... Is there anything you need from your cell? If there is time, I would like to center myself. 
There is a meditation chamber within my cell that I would visit one last time. Okay, do it. Is it, was it even a good idea bringing her here? I don't know. Uh, when she passed the surface, there is the force. Faces with her master. Will she be able to resist him? Where once there was a world that was strong in the force, now there is a barren wasteland. Your world. It has taken time for me to return here. I lost my way, but I've been stronger for the journey. What happens now shall not be done out of hate or revenge, but for the sake of all life. And I ask you finally to forgive me. This body is a prison no longer. Okay. Wizard has come to terms with the death of her world and calmed the hatred within herself. This has given her a stronger connection to the Force and a bonus to her Force points. Okay. What's in here? Yeah, that's how I go to that chamber. Is there a meaning for me to go in there? Not really, okay. Moving on. So... That's... That's not the way I need to go, I think. Not right now. And I see another door, but oh, Have you come to kill me? Why? The final ah, insult, Tobin. stripping Onderon, my soldiers, my home from me, only to have me die here. You made your choice. You are right. Ooh, look at the, the face. choice was mine. And you knew what would happen to me. What happened to you exactly? He happened. The hunger that fills this vessel. It is power, but it consumes without end. It is that power we felt on Onderon, that Vaklu felt. It was an echo, too strong to ignore. So you gave in to it. General Vaklu and I, when it seemed that we would need more to take Onderon, Make it strong again. He came <laughs> with his power, his soldiers. It seemed as if there was nothing we could not do. Nothing the Queen could do to stop us. And nothing you could do to stop him. I have served the wrong master. I know. He cares nothing for Onderon, its soldiers, its people. Everything exists to feed his will. I came here to this dead ship. And now he will not permit me to leave. Probably not. This ship seems familiar. We've been here this before. Ship, it is a graveyard of a terrible battle. Everything on it slowly dies as long as he hungers. It is the way of all life that serves him. In his presence, all life dies. This ship is from Malachor. This Sith Lord of yours bolsters his fleet with ships from that world? He's nothing more than a scavenger. I think he is of that place. If so, then his power may be great indeed. Greater than I had thought. Why did your master come here? The master suffers. If he cannot feed, then the hunger begins to consume him. The planet, Telos, he may feed on something upon its surface to sustain him a while longer. Hmm. But there's nothing here. Tilos is near that world. You think to lie to me still? I will not be deceived what again. What the hell are you talking I told about? You, you know, 
what the old woman told me. What did she? I told him of the academy here, of the Jedi here. I could not have kept it from him, even if I had wanted to. Old woman. He means that Jedi witch you mm. travel with, Kreia. Yes, the old woman on Onderon. She spoke of the Jedi Academy here on Telos, and my master was forced to come here. <sighs> there are no Force users here except us. Then her lies will mean the planet's destruction. Mm -hmm. He will destroy all of Telos. He will turn it to fire again and crush the planet beneath him. He will devour them all, murder them all. If there are no Jedi here, then my lord cannot feed his hunger. He will destroy the planet, the station. He will cleanse it of life. Mm -hmm. Even if the people below are not force sensitive, the small amount he can feed on from the mass destruction of the station and the life on the planet will sustain him a while longer. How? And if there are no Jedi below, he will have no other choice. Cute. <laughs> And if we deny him Telos? Then he will suffer. Without something to sustain him, I do not know what will happen. Ooh, I think Kreia knows. She's been drawing him out. If she leaked Telos to your lord, maybe she wanted him to come here and find nothing? He will create nothing. He will end this place. Your old woman has killed this planet, and with it, countless other worlds that depend on its survival. You could not stop him even if you wanted to. And you cannot escape either. If the Force runs through you, he will feed on it when Citadel Station dies. Your time, your life, will end here. Where can I find him? On the bridge. He waits on the bridge. Is he waiting for me? Waiting for you? No. He does not wait for you. I do not believe he knows his ship has been boarded. Mm. And if he did, he would not care. The extent of his power cannot be put into words. And his perceptions have grown as well. <sighs> to him. You are dust motes in a storm. A grain upon the beach. And as insignificant as a body that orbits the graveyard of Malachor. He's something Fight like Emperor, probably. But I if he know. turns his power upon you, you will be destroyed. <laughs> What about his ship? This ship, is it his weakness? It should not exist, yet it cruises the darkness between the stars. He tore it from the mass shadows of Malachor, along with his fleet. That is a measure of his power. <laughs> the ship is barely holding itself together. The structural damage should have destroyed it long ago. He holds it together. Mm. And he keeps us all alive. Just enough. Like rot worms within a dying beast. <laughs> More Jedi tricks. No. Not Jedi. Not Jedi at all. Yeah, not at all. If he's so powerful, why hasn't he stopped us then? We've attacked his ship, killed his soldiers. He doesn't know. This has just said. It is because he sees planets, stars, not people. To him, the planet below, the station with its teeming life. Only that is massive enough to demand his attention. Mm. So I am here to kill your master. Either help me or stand aside. There is nothing to be done except wait. If you go to him, he will destroy. No. And your last moments shall be of shadow and pain. We will see about that. There's a preservation here, okay. If you would save Onderon, traitor, then listen to me. Once he destroys Tilos, then Onderon will be among those he will destroy next. That's true. Onderon? But there's no longer any need. Well, he has touched Onderon and he will come back for it. You are right. As long as he exists, Onderon is in danger. Mm -hmm. The galaxy is in danger. What would you have me do? I need someone to set off the proton cores on this vessel when we give the signal. Go report to the target site, Colonel. I'll let my men know you're coming. And if you try anything stupid, they'll shoot you dead. I will do as you ask, for Onderon's sake. Go and do that. All right. Such acts have their own strength about them. I had forgotten. 
You've forgotten what? It's just a small one. It may seem that way, but perhaps it can become much more. We will I'm see. sorry, I did not mean to speak of it. Speak your mind. Principles of sacrifice and charity. These are things I have not seen in some time. I'm afraid that it will weaken you for what comes. No. But I have said enough, and you do not need my counsel. Your actions should, as always, be your own. Yes, they should be. So... Oh. All right. Just looking around. You've reached one of the target sites. Place the proton core, prime it. Then give the signal, Mandalore. Set it on. Arming signal received, Mandalore. The proton core is active. Two more sites are left. We've lost contact with two of our squads and we've had to fall back to the docking area. Okay, try not to give any more ground. Alright. So we go... Okay, we're done in here. I mean, not the last place that we need to be done in, but... We're on our way. Oh, hello! Come on! Let's do this! Ooh, the bridge! Yes! <laughs> Let me just check my journal. You have set the second of the proton cores, only two remain, but where are they? We didn't see them on the way. Okay, so I guess I'll have to find them. Alright. Oh, we still have way to go, so we'll probably find those charges. Alright, let's move on. Oh, people with lightsabers. Oh, someone was trying to. Light me up! <laughs> it's lightning! <laughs> okay. Hmm. Can we go that way then? Alright. Let's go that way then. No people in here? That's it. Is that no? Not working at all. Hmm. Oh no. But yeah. But. Wait a minute. There's a place that I need to reach over there. But not from here. I miss a place, okay. Hmm. 
Let's go. Whoops. <laughs> That's the problem with being too fast. <laughs> Save it down. <laughs> hmm? Okay. All right. So nothing done. I came here for nothing. I can't just unsee it. When I see it, I have to just <laughs> take it. Main deck? That's not where we're going. All right. Moving on again. Hello? People or lockers. This door leads to the bridge and my former master. If you wish to gather your strength, this is the last time. You don't need to come with me. It was never a question of need, and I would follow you wherever your path leads. This thing must be done. It must come to an end. Okay. Let's do it. Let's get in. Hello? <laughs> there he is. Truth, I have come to be your... What? No, that's not true. Lie, I have come to be your apprentice. No, don't do this. He will... Shh. I don't offer anyone a sacrifice. Surely you know why I'm unique. I could teach you to use the force in ways never seen in the galaxy. Yeah? Hmm. What the fuck just happened? I existed without the force of decades, now it ends. Master, what is wrong? <laughs> oh, he's angry. <laughs> oh! Oh no! Oh no! I need healing. Ah, oh. that is half that, not that. English, please. Is too powerful. He Stay with me, Visas. We can stop him somehow. Only need to keep him occupied until Tilas is secured. You're his link to this place. Can you distract that link somehow? Force preach, Visas? You are his weakness and you must be sacrificed. Can you distract his link somehow? I. I will try. Okay. He... I cannot hold him for long. Oh, let me just get him. Okay. Not that first. Do this. Then... 
go. Come on. Don't die already. I mean the one over there with the mask. What is he doing with that thing? Is he trying to like take the life out of me? Come on! Bye! I mean, can someone like him ever die? What the hell are you doing up there? We need to get off this ship! Now! Visas, what are you doing? I have to see with the Force and my eyes. See what? Look upon his face and bring me the mask. Leave the body. It is nothing now. Do it. Tell me what you saw. I saw a graveyard world, surrounded by a fleet of dead ships. I felt it through him, as I feel it through you. You are my master now, and I will follow wherever your path takes you. My path is at an end. Okay, then let this ship die as it should have years ago. Ooh. Anders, are you all right? Get away from me. I don't need your help. Just leave me here. Candorus, the Force lies in all living things. I have watched my people die. You will survive. You have no choice. You have been wounded before and lived, Mandalorian. Rise. Many battles do you still have left in you. You Isn't he dead? sound like Revan. Do you know what she told me in those last days on the Outer Rim? What? <laughs> that the Mandalorian Wars were our doom, and that we had been deceived. That it had never been our decision to wage war on the Republic. Revan said the Mandalorians didn't invade the Republic space ten years ago because it was our choice. We were tricked. Our entire people sacrificed as pawns and never knew it. She said there was a war coming, that it was waiting out in the unknown regions, in the dark, waiting for us to destroy each other. A war? This war? No, not this one. Another one. More terrible. Against an evil we couldn't begin to comprehend. A war of belief that had been fought for thousands of years. Revan went off to fight it. And left you here. Revan was one of the greatest military leaders in the galaxy. In history, she knew what she was doing. And I always Is he talking about orders. fight on belief like Jedi against Sith or something? Hmm. I mean the greatest evil force in the world, in the galaxy from what I know what I know is the Emperor. It's usually is always. By the way. How do I set those charges? There are people down there. I've been to everywhere I can. Where are the other charges? Let me check this one too. Can I even go down there? No, I can't. Alright, let's just sleep. Where do I remember this rocket from, really? Hmm. 
Let's go. Where are the other charges? You've reached one of the charges. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, do it. Arming signal. Oh. Yeah, yeah, sure. Almost done. I thought that it was the same and I skipped it, but damn. What the hell was that? I told you to wait! Mend it all. We've made contact with the enemy. And one of the cores has detonated prematurely. Was it in the target zone? No, Mandalore. We have failed you. I offer you my... Do we have another core? No, Mandalore. Even with the other two cores set in the ship, it will not be sufficient to destroy the hmm. vessel. We need to find another proton core, or we need to make one. All right, wait for my signal. This isn't over. And don't kill yourself before I tell you. <laughs> Okay, so uh, you have set the third of the proton cores. Only the re only one remains, but there is a problem. One of the proton cores detonated prematurely during a battle with Sith troopers. So you will need to find or build another one. I remember one. Uh, we found one, but where was it? Let me just check the map. Hmm. Okay, I found it. It's right over here. So let's deal with this. But, but... Look into its bay and it cannot be removed. You will need to find an alright console. And where that console might be... Damn it! It was right over here. Oh. Activate the launch sequence. Alright, emergency sequence. And then... Seal it, log out, and this proton core has been unlocked from its bay and it can now be removed. Remove? You retrieve the proton core from the missile bay. So what do I do with it? Uh, now you can use it to set the last charge to destroy the vessel. Where is this last charge? Two. Three, four, meditation room. Where is the fourth? Is it over there, maybe? Let's look. I think so, yeah, that Mandalorians. No? Target sites. Place the proton core, prime it, then give the signal, Mandalore. Okay, let's do it. Finally. Arming signal received, Mandalore. The proton core is active. That's the last of them, Mandalore. We can destroy the ship on your command. Okay, yes. Let's do that. How do we get out? <laughs> Uh, okay, I see. Run! It's going to explode! Run! Run, run, run! Oop. Yeah, I'm on the right way, so... Leaving. Do you wish to leave? Yes. Admiral Onasi wanted to speak with <laughs> you, ma'am. Really? As I understand it, there was something Did private he wished to ask you. Concerning, uh... Mutual acquaintance, I believe, is how he put it. Mm, okay. It's a little beat up, but it's still home. I wasn't able to be here to protect it when the Sith attacked the first time. This time you gave me a second chance. I owe you. Okay. 
Graham said you wanted to speak to me about a mutual acquaintance, Revan, probably. I've read your records. How the Jedi sentenced you for doing what you believed. You wandered past the Outer Rim during your exile. I ask you, did you find any trace of Revan? No. I served with her like you did, and we had to part like you did. Do you know where Revan went? She said that there were places where she had to walk where I could not go. Places that she could not bring those she loved. I've waited for her to come back for almost four years. It doesn't get any easier. Hmm. I'm sorry. Must be so hard. But the card on the romance is on, apparently. She might be dead. No, she's not dead. I feel like I would know. There's just this emptiness where she used to be. I would have done anything she asked. And when she told me to stay here, to try to keep the Republic strong, that was the hardest thing of all. Why did she ask that? I don't know, but it was important to her. She said that she believed something had been behind the Mandalorian Wars, that it hadn't been the Mandalorian's choice to attack the <laughs> Republic. Whatever it was, I think she went off to find it, to fight it. And that's why she wanted the Republic strong. How did you know, Revan? It was near the end of the Jedi Civil War, when it seemed like we were going to lose everything. We met on a Republic warship, called the Endar Spire. We were being attacked over Terrace, and the Sith had stormed the ship. We saved the Republic, but it was like the war didn't end for her. She would keep remembering things that she had done, and it kept driving her. And she kept using it as a wall mm. between us. And I think... She finally remembered something terrible she had done during the Mandalorian Wars, and she went to put an end to it. She left without warning. She didn't say where, only that it was to a place where she could not take anyone she loved. And here you return, with her ship, without her. Revan's ship. Yes, wherever she went, your ship's been there. If... if you return to that place, if you find some trace of Revan... <laughs> Do you want me to tell you what I find? No. Simply tell her that Carthonassi is waiting for her. Okay. I mean, does Revan ever come back? I mean... I played a little bit... Safe journey, exile. Swat her back then. Only the main stories of... Uh... Sis warrior... Imperial lose their lives. Not like Jedi Knight and Consular, I think. Five. And all the Jedi who followed Revan, the true Jedi, died at Malakor Five. We go now, my master, to that dark place which made you. Where you gained your ship, your troops. Your ship, my prison, that you dragged from the gravity well at Malakor Five. Wish I'd never met her. Wish I died there, that the storms had dragged me down into Malachor V. We will not surrender. We will not die, like we did on Malachor V. Your command echoes still, General, and I obey, as I did at Malachor V. Now Malachor V comes to us, and I wish to face it this last time. You know where you must go. It calls to you still. What are you doing? It is the heartbeat of the past. To and she must five. be stopped. There. Now. Or she will bring the screams of Malachor V to the galaxy. Just as we carry the echo all this way. Okay. What was I... <gasps> no. It has been some time. You were a fool to return. 
I spared you once. I will not do so again. Spare me? Ah, yes. No, you simply did not learn the lesson I sought to teach. That your strength is as meaningless as the strength of my hand. Why have you returned? Because now I understand why the exile did what she did. There is much to be done. <laughs> uh, and what was I saying, by the way? Uh, yeah, I played only the main stories, level 50 or some. Ah. Uh. Master, she is here. I know. What is thy bidding, my master? You are to do nothing. When she arrives, bring her before Damn me. it! <laughs> she may not survive Malachor. So touching. Can it be you still have feelings within that shell? Mm. Master, what will you do to her? You know what I shall do. You, who wear my teachings so well. I will break her. She is a blank slate upon which my teachings may be written, as you well know. Leave me. Await the arrival of the exile. When she comes, bring her before me. Yeah, what was I saying? Again, I played only some of the stories, not all of them, main stories that you go to until level 50. And from what I remember, uh, I, I didn't... I used to pay much attention to those stories, but I used to play uh, heroics and other stuff. I mean, the PvP stuff with my friends, and I remember there being a heroic or something else about Revan. And no, Revan is not going to return back, right? So poor Kaf Onasi. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, let's just finish it right over here because it seems like the, this is probably going to be the next one is probably going to my last episode of this game and yeah i'll see you then bye